Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams, and we're going to construct a basic histogram in Tableau. Alright, so I've opened Tableau, and first thing I have to do is get data. So I'm going to say File, and I'm just going to say Open. That's going to open my browser, and I'm going to select an Excel file from my hard drive. And it will think for a second. And what you'll see is you'll see that it shows sheets. And that's because the workbook that I chose has all of these different sheets that each has different type of data on it. Right? And so I need to select what I want to use. And I'm going to use high school SAT. So I can double click on that. As soon as I double click on that, what you'll see is that it has given me all of the different fields that I had in that Excel file and now here is basically the Excel data right um, the school number the math score the writing score the number of test takers and then the type it's important to notice that what you see is over the school the math the writing and the test takers you see your hashtag that means that's numeric quantitative data and you'll see this one is highlighted with ABC and that says that Tableau recognizes that that's a qualitative or non-numeric variable so I'm going to let me come down here for a second I'm gonna do what Tableau tells me and I'm gonna to go to my worksheet so in my worksheet what you'll see is that it's got my tables so type measure names those are both my qualitative variables and then here's my math school test takers writing counts right, measure values but what I want to do is I want to create a histogram out of the math variable so I highlight that and then I'm going to come up and over to show me what you'll notice is that for I could have a bar chart and it says down here that for a bar chart I need um, one or more measure but what I want is I want a histogram and it's going to create a bin it's going to create bins and fields so I'm going to close my show me by just clicking on it again I'm going to come down a little bit this is kind of tough to get on one sheet but we're going to try All right. and so now what you're going to see is that I have my data separated into bins and up top you can see that my columns are my math scores in bins and my rows are now counts so this shows count of math and I want this to be frequency so I'm gonna right click and say edit when I say edit we're talking about the axis title I'm gonna get rid of that I'm gonna type in frequency I just hit um, X to close it and it renames it down here it shows me math bin I don't want math bin so I hit edit I'm gonna come down to the title I'm gonna take this I'm gonna backspace over that and I'm gonna put math SAT scores and I hit X and now that's labeled now I need to change the name of my um, title because it's not sheet it is a histogram whoops of math SAT scores and I'm gonna change my font to something that's a little bit easier to read and then I'm gonna format it here center it and I'm gonna say okay so now I have a histogram of math SAT scores with my frequency labeled on my vertical axis 
and my um, horizontal axis properly labeled. Um, I can change the color if I want to. Right now there's just a plain border but if I want to have a border that's black in between all of my bars I can do that with color. Um, <clears throat> if I want to change my bin width, right now it gave me a automatic bin width of 20. I'll need to come up back back up here to my table which is math bin. I can click on that and I can say edit and you'll see that now it, I can let it suggest a bin size but let's say that I wanted my bin size to be 40 and then I hit OK and you'll see that my histogram changes. So adjusting your bin size is done up here in tables bin when I get to edit. Now I can go back and I could say that I want a bin size of 10 and it'll change my histogram according to that. So let's say that this is what I was happy with. Um, I'm going to right click here in this blank space and I'm going to select copy and I want to copy the image. That's going to copy this chart and I want it to show the title, the view, and the caption and I'm going to say copy. All I've done is opened a Word document. I'm coming up here to the paste function and I'm going to select the picture okay. and now I have my histogram as a picture in Word and I can make it smaller, bigger, I can save it, um, I could convert this to a PDF file, whatever I need to do with the histogram once I've created it in Tableau and I need to get it into another document. So although there are some other ways to create this in Tableau, using this show me feature here on the upper right is the quickest and easiest way to do it. So I hope that you found this helpful and as always I appreciate you watching.